Hey YouTube, Alex here on H95's channel, bringing you guys um, a quick uh, crazy deck idea. Um, I got this idea from uh, 510 Marino. He's a really cool guy. He's a friend of mine. Um, I know him personally. Uh, go check him out along with Royal Royale is Red. Um, another really cool dude. I know him both personally. Really cool guys. Great traders. Um, they're probably going to start doing stuff online. So uh, He gave me this idea. It's a dark deck and uh, I kind of wanted to make it a crazy deck idea. Um, it's a dark deck, so it's kind of weird, and it and it doesn't run like zombies or anything, but it's just fun and stuff. So I'm just going to get into the deck, because there's a lot of tech in here that I really want to explain it. So, yeah, again, it's a zombie deck. Um, it's kind of beat down -ish -y. Um, oh, okay. Dark Armed, obvious, it runs darks, pop stuff. Gores, Lifesaver, obviously. I run two Kaises, they're your win condition along with Dark Armed. Ooh, dark Armed. They're your win condition of the deck because you you bring out Kaisis quite often, and you can control your grave with a lot of the grave control cards for Dark Arm. Uh, and Kaisis are good against like everything, especially zombies right now in Light Swarm. Uh, it runs a D Hero engine, so Stratos. Too obvious, malicious. You synchro a lot with these guys. Um, really good tech and shit. So really broken. Um, Plasma I run scapegoats and it's really good. Um, it's kind of like a one-sided skill drain and a brain control. Diamond Dude, there's a lot of spells, especially in the side deck. You can hit a lot of them with this. Really broken. Fearmonger, um, these are all your D-draw tokens, by the way. Um, Fearmonger, bring your Malicious back to reuse them. Your Diamond Dude, um, he's just really good. He's kind of a floater. You can take him out for like another Diamond Dude or something else, or a Doom Lord if you want. Um, now, for the card, we're, the idea of this deck is to dump as many Darks as you can into the grave and go Dark Armed or remove them and do stuff. Um, I run Greffer in Armageddon Knight because it's a dark deck obviously you want to dump stuff and I'll show you what you guys are really going to want to dump really effective really broken um, and then I was kind of considering taking this out you could because there's 42 cards in the deck this is probably the card that I would take out uh, card trooper again use it to mill and it's a mini draw power um, and then to speed up the deck I run two mystic tomatoes they're really good um, just general searchers and you can abu you abuse their effects a lot when you search the other darks in your grave and then sack for Caius. Uh, Sangan, obvious searcher. And then the, the two cards that you're going to abuse a lot in this deck are necro the two necro gardeners. You try to get these in your grave fast. Um, they're just really funny. It's a dark deck so it's pretty good basically. It's kind of not really a crazy deck idea but it's just a uh, innovative dark deck idea kind of thing. And then your only two tuners are plague spreader which you abuse a lot and get him into the grave quick and Gale, because it's just Gale. It's really good. Uh, I was gonna run Krebons or something else, but I was like, eh, I, I I didn't have enough room for the teleport engine. But yeah, that's it for the monsters. For the spells, Rhoda, obviously you run Warriors. You can search a lot of the stuff. Uh, same thing with Sarko. You search your stuff. Um, just good. Draw power, 3D draws, and then more draw power to allures. Really broken draw card. Um, that's all I have to say for it. Scapegoat, you run plasma, and it's good defense. Brain control, mind control, take your opponent's monsters. Synchro, attack with it, tribute it for Caius. Heavy and MST for spell and trap removal. And then that's it for the for the spells. For the traps, solemn, lifesaver, dust shoot, obvious. Um, another win condition is return. You, get, you remove a lot of your cards from play, so it's really good. Um, staples, call the haunted. Um, I tech one wing blast because it's good. I think two is overkill. And then more staples are two bottomless, torrential, and mirror force for monster removal. And then my tech card, dust tornado. So really good. That was the main deck. Really fun. Um, the extra deck. It's kind of obvious, but I guess I can flash through it. Um, you use plague a lot, and if you were to run Krebons, you probably I run. That's why I run. I put this in here. Uh, Android, Cataster, two Brynax. A Goyo, a guy, and I, a Doom Kaiser in, ca in case you play against zombies. Black Rose, Armor Master because you're in Gale. Two Stardust, you bring these out quite frequently. I was gonna run two Colossal Fighters, but I could only find one. Um, Thought Ruler, still good. Red Dragon Archfiend and Mistworm. So yeah, I'm a little tired. It's actually quite sunny outside, that's why it's like shiny and stuff here, like back, like right up here. It's all light and stuff. The side deck, personal tech, I love this. Um, I just created it, but I like it. Reaper, really good against Lightsworns and everything. Just really good. 
um, giant true nade, spell and trap removal. If you if you're going up against like oppressions and stuff, if you, cards that you want to hit with your diamond dude are this and the two vertexes are really good um, to clear your opponent's field. I decide one book of moon really good because um, I didn't main it, so because I wanted to make space for other monsters like necro gardens and stuff. Um, just a really good card overall. You abuse it a lot. Like it's just broken, especially at three. Um, Skill Drain is a tech card, um, negates monster effects, and some of your stuff goes in the grave. Like, you go Malicious, Plague Spread, or Stardust, and they really can't use a monster effect to get rid of it when Skill Drain's out. Against Light, you can use that against Light Swords or the two mirrors. Um, my body, same thing, just stops negation, light, or, uh, destruction effects, Light Sworn, stuff like that. I tech one, Tragodian, because I didn't main it, I run Gores, I like this stop, so TKs. Another really funny tech card I love, Dark Lord Zerato. Love this card, so broken, especially against Light Swords. You get Darks into the Grave so easily, you can pop, bring this out. You go Tomato, you can suicide it if you want, or if they kill it, they bring out like ne you bring out like Necro Garden or Sangan. Um, you have four Darks, bring this guy out. Um, search for Sangan or something. Um, use his effect, uh, dump a malicious or some or just crazy stuff. Clear their field. Say they bottomless him or whatever. Or they torrential because they know you're gonna clear their field anyway. Um, he's a 2800 B stick. Really good. I was gonna main him, but I kind of didn't want to. Another tech card because you run searchers. Uh, creature swap. Really funny card. Um, not much to say about it. Just really I abuse this a lot. Autonomous action unit against. <laughs> See, I'm running a lot of random stuff. Like you wouldn't expect this. But autonomous action unit, free mon like it's not a free monster born, but it's kind of like a monster born. It's, it's good in zombies against zombies. Take their zombie master, ditch a plague or something, get your plague back or theirs. Go doom kaiser, do it all over again. Just really good. Um, not much to say about it. Attack the shit out of people, and then uh, attack one doom lord against zombies, and it's another D draw target. If you if you want to, you can take out like something else out of here, like a vortex or like a book of moon or something. And then put in another skill drain or a def and a defender to make this more usable. Three D draws in the main deck, and then finally a uh, tech in soul release because I hate light swords and black wings and all the stuff that is used in the grave. And you can control your graveyard with this, so it's really good. So yeah, that's the deck. Um, it's called Dark. I don't want to say Turbo. Cause it's not really a Turbo deck. Well, kind of is. Um, really fun deck to play. Um. I highly recommend it. Again, shout outs to Ro uh, Royal Real is Red and uh, well, I'm blanking out, blanking out. The guy actually gave me this idea. My friend Alex, um, he, not me, the other Alex, this other Alex, um, five one zero Marino. I'll have both their links in the description or somewhere like right here. So go check them out. Really cool guys. They need subscribers. So yeah, uh, that's the deck basically. Um, so yeah, um, just subscribe, you guys. I'm. I know you have getting a lot of stuff, a lot of responses for the for the contest, but yeah, um, I don't really have much else to say because I'm tired. Yeah, um, I had finals today, so uh, yeah, I guess kind of that's it. I really don't know. Um, moment of silence. Just me arranging stuff. Stratos flying off the page. Alright, whatever, I'm just tired. So, yeah, yeah. Alex, you're on Insta95's channel, you guys. Subscribe and, uh, peace.